Well, resilience is the first word that comes to mind. You know, we, we, we did a lot of things in regards to breast cancer awareness and each, each player picked somebody to play for. And we talked about the fight that breast cancer survivors have to go through. And at halftime, we just kind of went and said, guys, this ain't nothing. We're going to be fine. And we came out and we grinded one out against a really good team. LSU, this is like every Texas A&M LSU game. And, uh, but I'm really happy for all the right reasons that we came on top. It's amazing is about two minutes into the second quarter, we'd already given up 10 offensive rebounds. I don't know how many they got after that, but we really locked in. And it was a war in there because LSU is an outstanding rebounding team. And I thought our defense, especially in the fourth quarter, was outstanding. Well, the, the, the event itself was more important than the win. Uh, you know, that we told our kids, and our, we really meant it, that this was about a whole lot more than a basketball game. And if you can raise funds, if you can raise awareness, if you can lift the spirits of people that, that are battling cancer, then you've had a terrific evening, and that's what we did. You know, kudos to uh, my athletic department and Texas a University for all the people that got together and made this happen. Well, one of the best teams in the country, uh, without question, a Final Four team. And, uh, of course, uh, Vic Schaefer's an Aggie himself, bring, bringing his, his team back to home. So uh, we've had the ability to play with them the last few years. It'll take everything we got to hang in with them. But, you know, those, those kind of challenges you look forward to if you're a coach and a player. This is a really big win. As you can see, I'm going to show you all the name on the back of our jerseys were people that we just really cared for for breast cancer. So this is a really big win for us. And I think we all played very well for them. Yeah, this is a really big game. It's like a rivalry game between LSU and us. But I think we showed some really good maturity. And then we just grinded it out. We played for the names on the back of our jerseys. We did really well as a team. We ended up talking, you know, in the first half we got down. But we went in during halftime and we really talked about it. Like, hey, you guys, we really want to win this game. So we need to go out there and give it are all. Uh, our defensive performance, uh, they did a lot of good sets. A couple of times they got us, they set a lower ball screen, so it was kind of hard to defend Kayla Horner coming off the screen. She's really good going left, even though she's right-handed, but I think we adjusted well during halftime, and even their defense, a couple of times we struggled uh, getting the ball in the paint because they packed it in, but I think we overcame that, and then our defense, we ended up uh, figuring out their sets and did really well, and then rebounding, we did really well as well. As you can see, I got 15 boards, uh, and so everybody, a big concept that we worked on in practice this week was blackout and rebound, and I think we did that. Uh, I think it'll be a really good matchup. Uh, I'll be going against uh, Andriel and Big T. They're really good rebounders, so I think it'll be a challenge, and we'll see how it goes.